So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can upgrade all your software app in your computer just by using a command. And the tool that I'm going to show you how to use is called Winget. So this computer that I'm using, it's Windows 11 and you can use this tool in Windows 10 and 11. So I'm going to open up command prompt. And I'm going to right click the command prompt app and I'm going to click on run as administrator. So to get a list of the commands for Winget, just type Winget and hit enter. And this gives you a list of commands that you can use. So you can also install apps with this command line tool. You can also upgrade and uninstall. So to get a list of all the software packages in my computer, I just have to type Winget list. Hit enter. And it gives me a list of all the software apps that are in my computer. So here it tells you the name, the ID, and the version number of the software app. So to see a list of the apps that can be upgraded, I have to type Winget Upgrade. So in this section here, it tells me I have eight upgrades available. So if I want to upgrade all the apps that are listed here that need to be upgraded, I have to type Winget Upgrade dash dash all. Hit enter. So it says here two packages are version numbers that cannot be determined. I'm going to leave that as is. So it's only upgrading six applications. So I can install an app just by using Winget. So for example, I want to install Firefox. I don't have Firefox in this computer, so I'm going to install it with Winget. So I'm going to type Winget search Firefox. So it gives me a list of options and I'm going to install just Firefox. This is the one here, the second one, Mozilla Firefox and the source is Winget. So this is what I have to type here, Mozilla.Firefox. So to install Firefox, I'll type Winget install and I want to type it as is Mozilla.Firefox and hit enter and it's installing. So Firefox was installed. So to uninstall Firefox, instead of install, I just have to change that to uninstall. I'll hit enter and I'm going to get this prompt. I have to click on next and uninstall. Click finish and Firefox was uninstalled. So I want to install OBS. So I'm going to type winget search and OBS. So I get a list of options. I see the name, the ID, the version, and the source. So the source is Winget, and it's going to be OBS Studio, and it's OBS Project dot OBS Studio. So I'll type Winget install, and it's OBS Project dot OBS Studio. And I'm typing it exactly as it is spelled here. I'm going to hit enter. And it's installing. So it was successfully installed. This is the icon on the desktop. So to uninstall OBS Studio, instead of install, I'll type uninstall. Hit enter. I'm going to get a prompt. Click on install and OBS was uninstalled successfully. So to learn more about Winget, you can go to this site. I will leave a link on the description below. And these are some of the commands for Winget. You can scroll down the web page and you'll get a lot of information on the commands of Winget. So if you have an older version of Windows and you don't have Winget in your computer, you can download from GitHub. And this is the site. And when you get to this page, you just have to scroll down. So here is the installer file. It's Microsoft Desktop App Installer. You just have to click on it and it's going to download the file. So this is another option to download and install Winget. Just type in this URL and hit enter on your keyboard and it's going to download the Winget package. So I hope this video was helpful to you. I thank you for watching and I thank you for subscribing.